The race to rescue a teenage soccer team stranded in a flooded cave in Thailand continues. The options to get them out are few, and all of them are quite risky. NBC's Janice Mackey Frayer is live with the latest. Janice. Well, this is a very critical 24-hour period with heavy rain in the forecast. The pumps have been going here 24-7, trying to get millions of gallons of water out of this cave system uh, so that the evacuation of these boys and their coach can begin. Uh, we're told that the water levels now are at the point where roughly a third of the nearly three mile journey that they would have to make uh, is good, it's walkable, uh, the chambers are dry. There are other parts where the boys would be able to float with the help of Navy divers, but it's still those sections that are deep and narrow and twisting um, where the boys would have to dive. And this of course is a, a huge risk because none of them knows how to swim uh, and there is the risk of panic. Uh, the water levels have been going down roughly a half inch every hour. Once the rains come, and it's inevitable that they're going to come, this is the monsoon season here, uh, they could be rising five times faster than that. So that's why they know they have a very limited window of opportunity here. And some very tough calculations that are being made tonight, uh, including the order of evacuation. Do they send out the strongest first, the youngest, the weakest? We know from the governor of the province that there are at least three boys and the coach who are still not so strong. They've been underground for 12 days now. They're malnourished, they're exhausted. Um, so they're not sure they're in the best shape uh, to make this sort of escape. So decisions are being made hour by hour. Uh, behind me, they've been prepping hoses to take into the cave system uh, so they can pump fresh air for when this evacuation may eventually get underway. Hey there, thanks for checking out CNBC on YouTube. Be sure to subscribe to stay up to date on all of the day's biggest stories. You can also click on any of the videos around me to watch the latest from CNBC. Thanks for watching.